Countdown clocks is 8.30. Time for prayers from the attic. Up we go. Welcome to St. Paul's Church in Nantucket. There's always Boa. Last night's festivities. Mm -hmm. Here's Ali. I didn't have enough Boa exposure that last night. I should have wore it earlier. Well, we can bring it back out tonight, <laughs> Ali. There's like Boa feathers around. You're shedding, I think. Like Boa, but yeah. Here we go, over we go. A candle kind of went crazy last night, so that's, that's on hold. This is my card that Beverly sent, the icon of Jesus. The other card that Beverly sent last year, it looks like. Yes, we've got quite a lot of accoutrement um, up here in the so attic. Yes, it's right on. Uh, <laughs> that has grown since March 18th when we debuted. Time to um, no. probably to clean it out for the new year, but not not today. Oh, what do you want to clean out? Well, we've got a lot of papers and books. Maybe and papers and a few things, but not much. A lot of our, our props and our yeah, show and tell items. Yeah. Hi, Christine. Oh. Oh. Happy New Year to you. Hope you had a great day. Yeah. Trying to decide whether to go scalping tomorrow, Christine. It's going to be early. An early tide, so I don't know if I can handle it, but we'll see. After staying up last night till three in the morning, which was... Uh, Did we stay up till three in the morning? Three in the wow. morning. Wow. I know, it's unusual for us. Uh, we, had, we had a nice time last Eve. night. Yeah, I sat in front of the fire after you rang the bell. Did we have a fire, fire last night? <laughs> you know, we had we fire did. last night. Oh, yes. We did. <laughs> <laughs> he was sleepy, I know. <laughs> Oh my. Yes, we did. Eek. Well, anyway, it was fun. Yeah. We rang yeah. the bell at church. I'd never done that before. And Max, it's 500 pounds, that bell. I can't believe I was able to pull it. I know. On. Curt Curtis Barnes is our virgin. Does it all the time. Yeah. It's Sunday morning. I know. Yeah. So that was really fun. And I really look like Quasimodo doing it, you know? <laughs> I love the beginning of it. We did, I recorded Ollie and you heard. I'm pulling it. He's <laughs> pulling the car, but wasn't doing it. It tends to get going. It, it starts swinging, then it just it yeah, just yeah. goes on its own, right? Yeah. It's so balanced. Once it's swinging, it. Hi, it's Linda. Two or three minutes. Hi, Josie. Yeah. So, anyways, yeah. So. It was fun, Ollie. It was fun, fun, fun. Still is that nice, relaxing day. Went to the beach with meatball, and uh, just noshed tonight. I, we said to I, we said to Ali, don't cook a big meal. We can just chill. And that's so, right. You know. So well, that's fun. I'm getting off easy with dinners lately. I know. So. Let you off the hook. Mm. Of course, I could jump in more, Ali, but but that's don't okay. hold your breath. But you're, I'll try. You're the I've been man. cooking more since this um you, you have? quarantining or you know this um, lockdown or whatever you know the pandemic, right? Yeah. You're the omelet man. Um, yes, that's a, a special key. All right, so I guess I'll turn yeah, this so off. I guess so, Someone's yeah. calling. Yeah. yeah. And um, today's the feast of the holy name of Jesus. And so it's also New Year's Day, obviously, but it's a feast day. So we're happy to um, have this uh, service tonight. When I was in Delaware, we used to um, have a service at 1130 in the morning because we knew people would be sleeping in like we did today yeah. a little we tried mm -hmm. to mostly mm -hmm. um mm -hmm. and so and i remember one time it seemed like the i think we had 45 people in the side chapel at all saints church in Hobart beach it seemed like the tour bus had pulled up or something i don't know what it was that day mm -hmm. but it was our usual thursday healing service so you always get you know half a dozen for that and then the feast we advertised it some feast of the holy name not why they advertised but the word got out yeah, that was pretty cool, and uh, so we're happy to celebrate. And as my um, one of my professors at seminary said, when we use the word name in our, in the Bible tradition and our prayer tradition, we're talking about the reality kind of. You know, we we say in the name of the Father, and you know, in the, in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, and we're talking about not just the what we call God. Or, but the name in, in, in the reality. We baptize into the reality of, of God, 
not in the name on behalf of God, not in the name of. So in the in your name, especially capital N, you'll see in our prayer books, and that's a reference to yeah, yeah, I didn't the, know that. the reality, huh. the presence and reality of God. It's an order for compliment tonight, as uh, usual, page one twenty seven of the prayer book. Okay. And Book of Common Prayer. Lord Almighty grant us a peaceful night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. The maker of heaven and earth. No confession during Christmas season. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory, Glory to, to the, the Father, Father, and to the Son, and to the, the Holy Spirit, Spirit as, as it was in the beginning, beginning is now, and, and will be forever. forever. Amen. Amen. Alleluia. Okay, Psalm 8, I believe. Psalm 8. Psalm number 8. So it's found on page 592 of your prayer book. 592. Using your Bible, similar translation, slightly different. And this is, um, we'll pray up to the asterisk, I will, and I'll in the congregation can conclude the verse. 592. O Lord, our governor, how exalted is your name in all the world. Out of the mass, mouths of infants and children, your majesty is praised above the heavens. You have set up a stronghold against your adversaries to quell the enemy and the avenger. When I consider your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars you have set in their courses, what is man that you should be mindful of him? The son of man that you should seek him out you made him but a little lower than the angels. You adorn him with glory and honor. You give him mad mastery over the works of your hands. You put all things under his feet. All sheep and oxen. Even the wild beasts of the field. The birds of the air, the fish of the sea. And whatsoever walks in the paths of the sea. O Lord our governor. How exalted is your name in all the world. Glory, Glory to, to the, the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Okay, Olive. A reading from the Gospel according to Luke. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, let us go now to Bethlehem and see this thing that has taken place, which the Lord has made known to us. So they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the child lying in the manger. When they saw this, they made known what had been told them about this child. And all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds told them. But Mary treasured all these words and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen, as it had been told them. After eight days had passed, it was time to circumcise the child, and he was called Jesus, the name given by the angel before he was conceived in the womb. The word of the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be, be to God. God. Cool, Ollie. Christmas story continues. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gospel of Luke, familiar. Mm -hmm. uh, familiar words. And we could do a quiz. What angel was that that told Mary? Gabriel. Oh, good, good, Ollie. You've been paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> um, and so Gabriel got to name the God baby named Jesus? Gabriel, of course, as an angel, was the messenger oh, that's, from God. I, I know yes, that. Yes. I know that. But still, I just... Got to reveal. Is it the the uh, mm. infant reveal. The, okay. Can now they have these birth reveals. Reveal. I don't know what... The, gender reveals. reveals. That's right. Gender reveals. Yes, for the name. Given by the angel. Oh, okay. That's why I said that. Well, so that it was sentence, given, yeah, given the, by the, the angel. I can see that. Yeah. Yeah. But... The angel gave it to, gave it to Mary. So interesting, and again, as the psalm too, too, it's like the layers of, you know, it's God and angels and human beings. Our prayer book could be, we, we have another Bible that's um, 
or inclusive language um, psalms in, in New Testament. At, at, at Episcopal Divinity School, when I was at seminary, a, a, a couple of my professors gave me that Bible. And it's because of the, of course, in the original Hebrew from the psalm, it was, it was gender neutral. There weren't those pronouns. And so it's really humankind is, uh, you know, what, what is um, humankind, that God made humankind just lower than the angels? And who are we that God would pay so much attention to us? You know, it's kind of the message of that psalm, because we're, we're special, loved by God, each of us. And so here, it also used to be called the Feast of the Circumcision, which sounds a little uh, harsh, especially for male, for male babies like me. But, um, mm -hmm. <laughs> and then um, in the Anglican Communion, we called it in more recent times, the Feast of the Holy Name. It was the naming of Jesus, not the, the surgery that um, was an important part of his feast day. And the feast day goes back to the sixth century, somewhere around there, and um, uh, the naming of Jesus. And of course, um, in the name, remember Gabriel said that you'll name the baby Jesus because he will save his people, save his people. Right, Jesus means savior or deliverer in Hebrew. Joshua, it's also right, Joshua, I think, is the, mm -hmm. is, the uh, is another common name for Jesus. Yeah. Yeah, because he'll save his people from their sins, the angel said, right? Explained to Joseph, too. The angel explained to Joseph. Yeah. So, yeah, holy name of our Lord Jesus. So during these days, um, Love the Jesus prayer, just simple. Repeat the name of Jesus. You know, Jesus, Savior, is what just a simple two word prayer. We used to pray that at the monastery some. Just two words? Jesus, Savior. Yeah. And they say it's that redundant. over and over again? Mm -hmm. Just simply. Jesus, breathe like a, like a meditation, a breath meditation. Jesus, Savior. You know, I'd be breathing in and out with that, just those words, yeah. And then there was another, Martin used to do one, I think it was, um, it was like simple word, like Jesus save me a sinner. Something like that, would add mm -hmm. that one, a sinner. Mm -hmm. All of us make mistakes and, are, and we trust in God's mercy, not our own righteousness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Jesus, the, the, the feast of the Holy Name. This also was a, a day that um, in the Roman Catholic Church, they honor Mary especially on this day, the eighth day mm -hmm. of Christmas. I think it's the eighth day. I don't know the song very well. Do you know, Ali? No. Uh, 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 day of day of Christmas, my true love gave to me. I don't know. I don't know. It's not turtle doves. I don't know. Anyone know, know what happens in that song? The eighth day of Christmas. On and the so eighth I was looking, day of Christmas. Today I was looking at, um, we have this book. Our friend Beverly Hall gave us a book about the life of Jesus. It's backwards, of course, in Europe. And so a couple of, you know, when I was in seminary, Kwok Prilan, one of my great theology professors, who, who, who taught a lot about um, about creation, how that we we have to be proper stewards of creation. You know, environmental issues. This is you know, a seminary twenty five years ago, and Kwok Prilan was, was um, that was certainly important for her. Our, our care of creation. She had me plant a garden when I was on, when I was on sabbatical. But but also Kwok Prilan, who's um, she's from Hong Kong originally, great professor. Um, she had a slideshow, and it was Jesus of all different cultures. And you've heard me talk about it, maybe. It was the crucified Jesus. And he was, um, so crucified Jesus, one of the images was of a businessman. His briefcase was on the foot of the cross. Family looked like a very, you know, suburban family kind of at the foot of the cross. And there was, Je you know, Jesus dressed as a business person on the cross. There was one of Jesus as a freedom fighter, had a, a gun on the, on the, you know, next to the cross, um, camouflage. There were ones of uh, Japanese uh, images of Jesus, uh, Korean, African, and because um, and I remember when we were in uh, Boston, Ali, when I was at, we were at seminary at Cambridge. I went over to I guess it was um, Saint John the Divine up on Beacon Hill, uh, which was, was a, a church of the monastery beside Saint John Evangelist, the, the brothers, for years, and they had a. They had a black 
Madonna image, you know, big, uh, you know, uh, image, an icon of the black Madonna. And so I love that, you know, that Jesus is universal. Happened to be born in, as um, a Palestinian Jew, you know, but is, but is a universal savior, Jesus, savior, deliverer. So I love this one about the hero. Oh, sure. Yep, hold on. Yeah. And so th this one's pretty cool. Uh, this Madonna Patero, you recognize the style. I would think of Patero as uh, Mexico, but it's Uruguay. Right from Uruguay. Isn't that an interesting, um, cool image of, um, of Jesus? This one I like. This one is from Ethiopia. Ethiopia. Again, Jesus for all people, for all cultures, from the north, the south, the east, and the west. God will gather God's people. And look at this one. It's really striking. It's on wood, polychromed, and it's from um, Melanesia. Melanesia, there's Jesus uh, down there. Mm. Uh, oh, that's cute. That's, isn't that precious? <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So anyways, um, we oh. celebrate Jesus in our lives, again, during these times of, um, oh, here's, a, here's a sweet one, too. This is oh, a contemporary oh, one. Uh, Japanese. Yeah, that's sweet. Oh, oh. there go my prayer bead, darling. Oh. Actually, that's, from, that's not Japanese, it's from Korea. From Korea. So we celebrate Jesus, Savior of all. And um, again, we don't force our, our beliefs and religion on others. We believe um, that they have their own wisdom about mm -hmm. God, that God is revealed in many ways and in many cultures. For us that are followers of Jesus Christ, just the name of Christ is powerful in our lives. Like, you know, it's a reminder of the presence of Christ in our lives and that we strive in our lives to model as much as we can the compassion of Christ, the mercy revealed of God in Christ, um, you know, that we're be agents of reconciliation um, as Christ would have us do. And um, so we pray for that, Ali, on this feast day of the holy name of Jesus. Amen, Amen to that. In the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Now what, Ollie? This one I picked because of the honoring the name. Yes. On page. And I don't know if we know 430. it. Four thirty. Oh, so I posted four thirty-eight. Same words, but of course the hymn that we know is four thirty-seven. It's "Tell Up My Soul." And um, if I sing the bass part, Ollie, don't get distracted. Well, and it is very similar, but this is the, this tune. Birmingham is what we know. So 437, if you followed what we sent out earlier, the same words, anyway, the same mm -hmm. author, mm -hmm. Timothy Dudley Smith, Ali. Okay. Based Let's... on the Song of Mary, the Magnificat. Okay. Tell out my soul The greatness of the Lord A numbered blessings give my spirit for Tender to me the promise of his word. In God my Savior shall my heart rejoice. Tell out my soul the greatness of his name. Make known his might the deeds his arm has done. His mercy sure from age to age the same. His holy name the Lord, the mighty, the Lord, the mighty one. Tell out my soul the greatness of his might, pounds and dominions lay their glory by. Proud hearts and stubborn wills are put 
hope to fight. The hungry fed the humble, lifted high. That's close enough. <laughs> Tell out my soul the glories of his word. Firm is his promise and his mercy soul the greatness of, <laughs> tell out my soul the greatness of the Lord to children's children and forevermore what happens while we fell off the bus mm -hmm. tell uh, sure. tell out my soul. Oh. we sing this one all the time but for some reason it's 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 going, different every it's time. Going a little, it's going a little haywire tonight. Oh, what you people have to put up with <laughs> when it comes to our singing. Okay, so we're on page 134, 32, halfway down the page. I forgot the page. All right. Okay. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Keep us, O Lord, as the apple of your eye. Hide us under the shadow of your wings. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our, Our Father, Father, who art in heaven, heaven hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, hear our prayer. And let our cry come to you. Let us pray. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this life may rest in your eternal changelessness. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. O God, who wonderfully created yet more wonderfully restored the dignity of human nature. Grant that we may share the divine life of him who humbled himself to share our humanity, your Son, Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Amen. And keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night. Give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, Lord Christ. Give rest to the weary. Bless the dying, soothe the suffering, pity the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. Amen. Okay. Oh, so Amen. we have prayers of intercession. Uh, tonight we ask for you for you to pray for Max's mother. Jackie. Jackie. Yeah. In the hospital tonight, so. In the hospital. Um, we ask for your prayers for Kyle Danish and his family. We ask for prayers for Kirk's mother and for Megan and Henry. Uh, we ask for um, prayers for Mike and Katie and for Mika and for Beverly and David and for Peter, for Ruth and John, for Skylar and Paula. Claire and family. Yeah. Ted and family. We ask for your prayers for Roberto and Aaron. Department of Health. Uh, for Peter's sister Nancy. For Diane and Mozart. Uh, for Josie, Melissa, and Ellie. For Deacons Natalie, James, and Susan. For Sarah in Point Reyes, California, we um, ask for your prayers for Brandon's dad, Jim, and also his mother. We ask for your prayers for Angela and for Brookie and our bishop, Alan Gates, his wife, Tricia, and Gail Harris, our suffragan bishop. Kelly and Christina, Kelly, my uh, regional canon, David, my dean. We pray for um, Allison's son, Lucas. We pray for Linda, my dear friend Linda, and for Janet and Pat. Joseph, for Adam, 
Normand and Bim. We pray for those serving in the armed forces and their families, especially uh, this time of the year when it was separated. Mm. Um, we pray for our uh, psychiatric social worker friend, Jeff, working with our returning troops. Here's my nephew, Justin, serving in the Coast Guard in California. Um, we pray for our seminarian, Jonathan. We pray for the Nantucket Cottage Hospital staff and volunteers and the Fairwinds Counseling Center and for the safe place. Crisis Center. Crisis Center. Also, we ask your prayers for the Nantucket Interfaith Councils Ministries, for the Community Foundation of Nantucket. Um, we pray for uh, all, of, all people that are homeless and we and we pray for those that help them especially Emanuel shelter in delaware we pray for the med flight crews and coast guard crews first responders police and firefighters we pray for medical communities and research communities all around the world and for lucy's family working in those communities we pray for the work of the Mission Committee at St. Paul's and especially their feeding ministry here on the island. We pray for Sarah Jane and all those suffering from mental health issues. We pray for all the teachers and we pray for their students and we pray for the parents of these students. We pray for all children everywhere and children at risk. We pray for Julie and Matt and Mark and Etna and Evan and Maria and for Megan and Justine. Our chefs. We pray for our musical friends Peggy and Sherman and um, our music director Joe Hammer. Buddy Cavallari, and Buddy folk Cavallari. artist. George um, Young, our saxophone friend. We pray for Pastor Enoch Fuzz of Corinthian Church in Nashville. We pray for Noah McMillan and his family. We pray for Liz and Peter and for Shirley and for Marshall and for Bruce, my brother. Um, I think that's for Deb and her brother Bob, and I guess that's a peace, justice. Justice, peace, peace and unity. And, um, and for a happy and healthy year. Any resolutions, others? Let's have a resolution tonight. Uh, I guess we were going to maybe do that. <laughs> maybe it's the operative word. <laughs> we'll think of it. Oh, well. We'll see we what always, happens, though. Yeah. I, know. I, I don't really feel like saying what, I, what my resolution is, but um, yeah. that's okay. I mean, it's not... Health. Well, yes, health. Health category. Health and uh yeah health peace of mind that kind of thing you know sounds good Alan. So, serenity serenity yes so okay. good good okay yeah. alice thank you very much you're welcome service so, continues bottom of page 134. 134. Let us pray together. Guide us waking, O Lord, and, and guard, guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Lord, you now have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior, whom you prepared for all the world to see, a light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was, was in the beginning, beginning, is now, and, and will, will be forever. forever. Amen. Guard us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Let's bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Okay, so tonight, uh, Max found something um, on uh, Facebook, and... It's Yo-Yo Ma, and I'm going to read a little introduction that he wrote. I'm friends of Yo-Yo Ma. I'm yeah. And hold on now one second. Um, 
It's something you dedicated for the new year. Oh, can I? Yeah. Uh, wellness comfort. Should I? I'm going to identify read. it as. We usually start the year quietly, but this year we need energy. We need everybody's energy to rebuild and to move forward. We need to commit to fighting for a world that allows for everyone to be healthy and to thrive. On this New Year's Day, I hope that this musical flow of energy charges you to move, to act, and to feel common purpose. Happy New Year to you all. This is Prelude to Prelude to, to Cello Suite Number no. 6 in D Major, J.S. Bach. Johann Sebastian Bach. Okay, so hold on a second while I... Start from the beginning. Here we go.
Maria. Maria. Gotcha.